Hey everyone, I'm Lou and you're watching Live Free and DIY. Didn't get a chance to get a project video out last week because my brother-in-law and mother-in-law were staying over and we were just super busy with just family stuff and then my nephew came over to spend a night and the house was jam-packed. Plus my brother-in-law brought his dog Patty who is one of the best dogs and all of our dogs got along with her. It was just, it was a really good time. It was good to have everybody here together. So I didn't get a chance to get in the garage. But that's okay because it was also like 100 degrees every day. Oh, by the way, if you don't know who my brother-in-law is, his name is Rick Brantley. He is a singer-songwriter that lives in Nashville. I'm going to put a link to the latest video he posted on YouTube. You should head on over there, definitely subscribe to him, and check out his music. He has really good music. And he's a really cool dude. I love him to pieces. He is basically like my brother. You should know that today is the last day you can win this paracord bracelet. I will pick a winner at the end of the day when the contest is finished. I'm gonna try to do a live stream like I did last time, but you've only got one more chance to win this, so enter now. The link is somewhere on this video and in the description below. I'm not sure if or what I'll give away next month because I've only had a couple of project videos out and those projects are things that I definitely want to keep. But one of the project videos I was planning on putting out soon is kind of a DIY starter lock pick learning kit. So I'm thinking about making that and possibly giving that away. Because I already know how to pick locks and I think everybody should at least learn how to pick locks. Not because people should be nefarious, but because it's a good and useful skill to learn that can help you help other people. And last week, the Smarter Every Day channel put out a really interesting video about why you should put your oxygen mask on first if you're ever in a plane incident. It was really interesting. I really enjoyed it. A lot of my friends really enjoyed it. So I'm gonna put a link to that in the description. Definitely check it out. Also, there's a new channel on YouTube called Clever Current. Check it out. They recently interviewed my friend Zach from Southern Ginger Workshop. It was a pretty good interview. Uh, I think their whole point is to start interviewing makers in the maker community that are on YouTube. So subscribe to them. You could learn some interesting things about some of your favorite makers. And of course, I will put a link to that in the description below. There hasn't been much else going on around here. I did finish 12 Monkeys, and I gotta say, I wasn't impressed by the finale. I did not enjoy it at all. I mean, there was something that happened that was like a shock moment. And it's not that I wasn't shocked, it's that I kind of expected something similar but different to happen, and I just... I just wasn't impressed by the ending. But I but I really like this season overall. I hope they just pick it up on the third season and just do something cool with it. But I am still doing something 12 Monkeys related in this workshop. Probably making a clock. Well, I think that's about it for this vlog video. Please hit the like button and hit the subscribe button and leave a comment below. Check me out on Instagram and Twitter and Facebook or any social networks that you can find me on. All the links to that are below in the description of this video. I really appreciate you guys. You are totally awesome. I am well over 300 now, which is so cool. You guys are great. I love you all. I hope you all have a great weekend. Try to stay cool in this heat. And I should see you next week with a new project video. Thanks again. I'll talk to you later. Bye. I caught a Pikachu.